Broadcasting live from the Vile Stadium in San Francisco, home of the 40 Nightmares. You know why this team is named that? Because their fans are known to wake up in a cold sweat screaming at the top of their lungs. <laughs> I don't blame them. Don't poke fun at their city, Grim. Plenty of great places to eat if you like vegan. Hey, I love to eat vegans, but they always whine when you're cooking them. Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Baltimore Razors battle. The San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, man, the team's on the panel now. You know what happened? It's time to tune in, turn on, and drop what you're doing because NFL Game Day is on the air. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. So what's the game plan for the home team today, Bricks? Uh, I think they got to keep it simple. A little cough syrup, maybe smoke a little untidy pot pregame so they can keep their heads in the game. I mean, literally. You don't want to get decapitated on the opening kickoff. I say go after the refs early and often. No mercy. Hot one, hot two, hot, hot. You can tell he's a berserker because he's frothing at the mouth. Oh. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Hey, man. I'm still a little I am a hell of a son of Second down in a very lot. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. Third down and nine. First and ten. Man, what a hit that was. Second down and seven. Up maybe a deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a. Uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? He threatened me if I didn't tip him next time. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well placed cleat. First down and seven. Take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? And the easiest play in the league, and he chokes. Yeah, he's a choker. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. First and ten. Oh. 
Second down and long. That run is good for 10 yards. Third and four. And the ball razors through the defense, cutting a defender in half. That means he can wrap up the other. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. It's a touchdown. If you don't understand why refs are hated even more than kickers, <laughs> well, there's your answer, Bricks. I know, I hate those zebra men. Third down, and, well, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. QB is saying his prayers. And that's the way you do it. Eat up chunks of yards with pinpoint passing. I don't understand why they're going for it, Grim. This seems like the situation where they should always, always, always... And he just used his beast boost dirty trick in their... Oh, wow. A run on fourth didn't work out. Who could ever have seen that? You know what? Leave snarking the noobs to me, Grim. That's my job. And it's first and ten. And the quarterback finds his man for the first down. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps outside. To... <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Oh, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. First down and seven. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a greased turkey. Why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. And that's a good by the numbers throw. And those numbers add up to two. Yeah, hey, man, I was going to hit him now. You know what happened? They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. And it's first and ten. Nice pickup for six yards. And that'll be second down and four. Oh, great tackle! When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. Third and two. Man, guys like a 
freight train. Nice pick up there for a first down. And it's first and ten. First down. And the running game opens up for them and allows the passing game to be more of a threat. Got to keep them guessing. And it's first and ten. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. Tired of the quarterback's tight spirals and, and then unsportsmanlike play of the day brought to you by the good folks at Speedy's drive through Funeral Parlor Service located just off the Beltway exit five. First and ten. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Bricks. This is going to get ugly fast. up the first down. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot. He dropped it. If he does that again, they'll drop him. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two. Hot. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking, and that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You yeah, know, they're all in politics, apparently. Hot. if he splits the uprights from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. Hey! Well, surprise me. He made it look easy, and he gets three points for it. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. Well, he made the 
pass, but then a slap in the face by the defense. Oh, that's me in the hotel bar every night. Hey, your opening line needs work. Why? Really? What's a pretty girl like you doing here all by herself? Are you a hooker? Well, it's a fair question. And that player just transformed into a giant. There's no reason to drop the ball if you're still alive. Third down, and the punter is warming up. Oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, sounds like my offseason. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a return. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners. Put returners in. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grin. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> oh, what a sack there. I heard this guy likes to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Second down in a lot. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Third down in forever. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. friends was an all-pro NFL hit and it's first and ten Hot. and we're at the two-minute warning I gotta pee and it's first and ten Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Hot. oh what the brutal hit Under two minutes, a timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And that'll be second down and four. Hot one, hot. <laughs> they've got one more timeout left, but they've stopped the clock. Why don't they just take the batteries out of the clock, Grim? That would make more sense. Third down and five. Hot. That was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I'll bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Uh, let... The defense calls their first time out to save some clock. I save clocks too, Grim. My wife hates them. They take up the whole garage. Wait, what? You're married? Uh, it's complicated. Hey. And I don't want to see the comment section on that replay of the kick. Yeesh. That was terrible. Yeah, he's going to get the right fuckle treatment after that, miss. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. This game is all about momentum and killing. <laughs> The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just cock blocked the clock. And it's first and ten. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop from throwing that good, Ben! You mean aside from priming the ref? Quarterback, or actually playing some D. <laughs> They're going for two points. Two 
Cheap one plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot. Whoa, and he laterals the ball to the player behind him. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. And that's the last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. Can any of us really stop the clock, Grim? I mean, when it comes right down to it, are we not all united by the constant reminder of our own mortality? Of that constant, relentless advance? If only it was as easy as telling that. And that's a run for no gain. Then it's not really a run, is it? Third down and five. Hey. It's two-yard run before he stopped. <laughs> and no more timeouts. The D needs to stop. This is intense. No, Gwen. Camping is intense. <laughs> Get it? Idiot. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. And he booted a high arching rainbow. The return man catches the ball and heads upfield. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name. The second quarter comes to a close as the teams head for the locker room and we take you to halftime. Brought to you by Monsatan Industries. We make genetically engineered food that is to die for. It's the start of the third quarter, and we are set to go, Bricks. Oh, boy! Where we going, Grim? A carnival? Huh? Uh, we're going to go to a strip tease show. Where we going? Hey, why don't you settle down? Just pet your rabbit, Lenny. Yeah, just no. pet your rabbit. Get him now. Get him now. <laughs> They need a good return here to set up the offense. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Second down and nine. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the Q. It's not how many times you fall, it's how you get back up. Yeah, in this particular case, I'm thinking defibrillators and 100 cc's of adrenaline. <laughs> and it's first and ten. It. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. I lost so much money on him, not to mention my kneecaps. My loan shark is very anal about collecting my money on time, Graham. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hey. And he's off to the races. for a first down to keep the drive alive. First down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a pick ahead. Get the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. He 
was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. The ref calls a penalty. You know, the MFL has eliminated almost every penalty in the rule book, and yet it still feels like there's way too many penalties. Stupid jerks. You guys suck. And that'll bring up third and one. And he runs it in for the touchdown. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. And he gets into the end zone for the conversion. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. And the defense gives up five yards there. Second down and five. Hot, hot one, eight. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot Picks up eight yards on a strong run. Second down and two. And the defense goes for the juggler and run. Now the QB has to try to run out of bounds before they get to him. Needless to say, with seven crazed defenders coming after him, that's not easy. Ah, the old quarterback shellac play. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. The defense better look out. The offense called the Beast Boost Dirty Trick. With me, you get my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. You understand me? Don't want to make any mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It goes right through, yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck off. That was just a one-time thing. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Sticks his fingers in the defender's eyes, netting him a pickup of about eight on the play. Second down and two. He is running like an old guy looking for a bathroom. First down. 
and it's first and ten. Well, Mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. Nicely done for a first down. And it's first and ten. He blasted and picks up seven yards right there. Second and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh, with the brutal hit. First and two. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot three. Oh man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Oh, I'm going to get it. And then I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot three. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's game. Hang on tight. The fourth quarter is about to begin. Third down, and, well, good luck. He caught it, and nothing was going to stop him from getting into the end zone. Except maybe self -dying. But he seems to have worked through it. Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. could have made that kick. Isn't your sister in a wheelchair? I know, right? Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chick wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Great run for a nine-yard gain. And that'll bring up second and one. And that's a nice run for a first down. And it's first and ten. Like he just ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. When defensive players go berserk, they've been known to... Ooh, that hit's going to shave a few days off his life. Third down and six. And then it's a first down from a great catch. What? 
us in a catch, though. Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And he laterals the ball. Man, these guys like playing high risk. First down. And this guy is a stud, Bricks. They're telling me. Nice run. No, I mean, he's a real stud. He works at the Mutant Stud Farm weekends and summers. Second down and more than the QB would like. And a nice pass for a 10-yard gain. It's not a first down in the stat line, but it's a first down in our hearts. And that'll bring up third and one. And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. All I need is 77 to bite it. 40 nightmares win by forfeit. Heard the expression left it all on the field? Well, they left the other team's bodies on the field. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you I... shut the hell up right now and we go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say? Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.